Dave Evan here, um, Kawasaki, and just want to ask you a couple questions because uh, you've been writing for a while. You've been writing everywhere, but what what got you started writing? Um, I came here when I was in high school, and uh, my first time to Road America, I saw motorcycles, and I fell in love with the uh, the vision that this guy had on the front That noise. That noise. That everywhere, but you, you left the Midwest. Yeah, I, a little bit. I started in the Midwest, uh, had a great run with the Midwest, Midwest. met a lot of fun, fun friends and uh, people. And, um, as I progressed, I felt as though that I wanted to try to meet people that day. And, uh, I always heard that was helped. They wrote a lot more throughout the year, and I felt as though that I could probably own my skills a little better than myself. So what experience did you gain? Uh, you said you wanted to gain yeah, more experience. I was gained a lot of diversity in riding styles, different uh, asphalts, different track layouts. You go to a racetrack like Road America and you have a natural flowing long layout. Uh, you go to Loudoun, New Hampshire and you have a partial NASCAR track along with Homestead and uh, a little bit different style of concrete and uh, asphalt throughout the country. I felt that helped me out a lot and uh, you know you meet a lot of neat people along the way and it kind of keeps you going. kind of gave some confidence when you're going to a new track and you don't necessarily know. Definitely helps you coming to any track uh, for the first time and having some confidence going up for a few laps. You don't find yourself getting scared, nervous. Uh, you just really want to, you know, battle the track and not get overwhelmed with all the environment and all the other riders that are out there. So it helps you keep your mindset. So, what advice would you give to a rider starting off like yourself? You started off high school, but if you could give them advice or uh, my advice, I guess, for people would be stay consistent, be true to what you really believe you want to do as far as if you, if you want to ride every single weekend and that's you, that's what you, you know, keeps you smile on your face, keep doing it, stay consistent with it, don't do it for any other reason, don't do it for someone else, don't do it uh, to be with your buddies, if it's something you're just hanging out with them, I mean, really, if you want to ride, just go ride and I think that'll pay off and uh, I've been racing for 20 years now and uh, I love it as much as I did the first weekend. So if someone wanted to get started, you say just get out, you got your bike, get to the track, do some track days. Track days are pretty popular now, uh, whereas they were not. Uh, I would say do track days, uh, but you also need that racing environment. You need to learn the, the, uh, the schedules and uh, uh, going to tech and you know, proper lingo throughout the track, giving you some advice. I mean, the people that are actually racing. 